Shalom, Akim. Uh, I'm going to come back with another lesson. I want to give all praises and glory and honor to y'all by Shem Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the elders of Great Millstone. Much love, respect to you brothers out there doing the work in sincerity and truth. Keep pushing, keep fighting. Uh, basically, I want to get into a lesson talking about how Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, the world, who the world called God and Jesus, is only dealing with, with his people. And the Bible was only given to his people. The law, statute, commandments was only given to his people. Point blank, period. Okay? It's, it's just getting annoying to me. You know, these people coming up to me out in the highways and the byways and trying to talk about the Gentiles, this, that, and the third. And you know what I'm saying? It's 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 uh it's vexing, okay? But I want to just jump into it real quick and uh bring out the first scripture in Isaiah chapter 63, verse 17. It says, O Lord, why hast thou made us to err from thy ways and hardened our heart from thy fear? Return for thy servant's sake the tribes of thy inheritance. The people of thy holiness have possessed it but a little while. Our adversaries have trodden down thy sanctuary. We are thine. Thou never bearest rule over them. They were not called by thy name. Right. So I just wanted to speak on this a little bit because... The ones that the Most High is dealing with are the, uh, the is, is is the elect of out of the nation of Israel, okay, and uh, it says the tribes of his inheritance, okay, and you can't get around in in any of that, man. You know, it's it's this is the truth, whether it be in the Old Testament or New Testament. Either way, it it, it it's all the same, okay. This is Amos three and one. It says, "Hear this word." That the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel, against the whole family which I brought up from the land of Egypt, saying, You only have I known of all the families of the earth. Therefore, I will punish you for all your iniquities. All right. So it was Israel that went off and, dis, uh, and disobeyed our power, Yahweh. So therefore, we're in the condition that we're in right now. All right. We're here in America where we're, we're bound and and, 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 and and these chains of the flesh and and, and, and bound in our minds spiritually, uh, you know, uh, fighting against different uh, spirits, things of that nature, and ultimately just being brought over here to serve slavery and, to, and being held in, our, in captivity, okay? But the Mosai has only been dealing with Israel all this time, all right? From, from the beginning of Genesis all the way to the end of Revelations, man, you know? And these Edomites, they have these uh, this audacity to try to be talking about how that that they're the gent or the uh, the Gentiles can be saved when they have no understanding about who the Gentiles are that's spoken of in the scriptures. Okay, the majority of the time that's spoken about the the Gentiles in the scriptures is talk, referring to the Israelites, man. These are like foreigners. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go to Isaiah chapter 45. All right. Let me see. This is uh, Isaiah chapter 45, verse 4. It says, For Jacob, my servant's sake, because what I read just a while ago in Isaiah 63 and 17, it said, uh, it said, uh, Return for thy servant's sake the tribes of thy inheritance. So who's who, who's the servants that Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai has chosen? I'm going to read it right here. Isaiah 45. And four, for Jacob, my servant's sake, right? It says, uh, it's locked. Let me start up. Let me start right here at verse three. And I will give thee the treasures of thy of darkness and hidden riches of secret places, that thou mayest know that I, the Lord, which call thee by thy name, am the, am the God of Israel. For Jacob, my servant's sake, and Israel, mine elect, I have called thee by thy name. I have surnamed thee, though thou hast not known me. Right. So that's who uh, the the ser the servants uh, are of 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 the Most High. Jacob, man, the twelve tribes, all the way from Judah to Issachar, man, the twelve sons of Jacob. And that's what he's going to give us. He's going to give us those hidden treasures, and he 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 gave us the the mysteries. Or the uh, wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. All right, he's revealed the uh, the secrets unto the prophets, man. 
And who are the prophets? Israelites. You know? And and there's 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 so many scriptures to get into and to bring all this out. But I just want to make this a quick point to the best of my ability, man. You know? It shit's just vexing all the time. And and, and you know, it's just but it, it's, we're coming into a time where they're gonna be they're gonna see the strangeness of our salvation, man. You know? And that's what we can't wait for. Hastening the day of the Lord, hoping that we're part of that number, the elect. All right, so we can get out of here, man. This is uh, Psalms 147 and 19. He showeth his word unto Jacob, his statutes and his judgments unto Israel. He had not dealt so with any nation. And as far and as for his judgments, they have not known them. Praise ye the Lord. That's what we're doing. We praise the Lord, man, for it. You know, fuck you other people out there that have a problem with, with us. Uh, uh, telling you that not everybody can be saved, that the uh, Edomites, the so-called white people, the Edomites, the Amalekites are going to be destroyed. All right, the stock of Esau. All right, they're going to be destroyed. You know, uh, in these other nations, man. You want to you want to hold hand in hand with these other nations, these heathens, and so be it. You're going to be destroyed along with them. All right, because according to the scriptures, the Most High is not a part of that. All right. But I basically want to bring those scriptures out, brothers. I hope it was edifying. Once again, I want to give all praises and glory and honor to y'all. By Shem Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the elders Great Millstone. Much love and respect to you brothers out there doing the work of Syria and truth. Keep pushing. Keep fighting. Till, till next time, I want to say Shalom.